Bei mir hier sind jetzt Death Star Assembly aus Amerika. Die Jungs kommen aus dem Sunshine State, Florida. Sehen allerdings nicht so aus. Guys, you arrived uh, last night, early in the morning. Yes. So just tell us about the show, about your tour. Tour, you will maybe go back to America or keep here in Germany. Just tell us. Sure. This was our first show in Europe, which is an amazing experience to do Summer Breeze. Germany, beautiful country, we enjoyed it. The crowd, we were here all day yesterday, amazing festival. It was awesome. I mean, tell, tell us a little about what your experience with the festival itself. One of the best things we noticed is the, the crew and just the overall communal feel, much different than festivals in the States. It's a lot more family oriented here. It feels calm, comfortable, fun, lots of fans. It's very aggressive in the US, a lot different than here. And the best thing about this type of uh, Summer Breeze, it's such a diverse, different types of bands. I mean, you got Fiddler's Green, you got Cannibal Corpse, you got Dead Star Assembly. I mean, it's just, it's just a good mix. You got Guar later tonight. It's awesome, man, beautiful. So maybe now you can explain to the to the visitors which uh, different kind of music you're inviting to your show. Sure, it's it's you know we're a hard rock band, but we introduce electronic elements. We got keyboards, a lot of sound design. Just a you know it's just a very sonic experience but with a hard rock edge. I mean we're big into 80s hair metal. We're big into you know 80s new, wave. 80s new wave. I mean but you know our drummer we all have different influences. Big into dark metal. I mean yeah. tell them about your influences. You know, I, I really love. The Swedish metal, um, melodic death metal, and you know some of the the earlier Manson and Nine Inch Nails. You know those have been big influences on me. So you kind of throw that all into a cauldron and brew it up, and that, that's Dead Star Assembly, man. That's our sound. Cool. So, and you, um, how many uh, CDs you already got? This is our. We just released um, our new album, Coat of Arms. It came out in May in Europe. It came out in April in the States. Uh, we have our album in 2006 came out called Unsaved in Europe and also in the States. And then we have our debut back in 2002 when we started. So we're about eight years old, our third release. And we finally got to Europe and Germany kicks ass. Definitely metal. Thanks so far. Um, another, maybe you all, um, already got a crazy story on the festival. You saw something really wild or... You know, everybody's here so well behaved, you know, everyone's cool, you know, and the, even the police, funny story, we were driving in yesterday, we got lost, and the police actually escorted us in to get to the artist VIP area, which would never happen in the stage, which was awesome. Also, uh, you tell them about your keyboards. I mean, that yeah, was pretty we cool. had a problem with, we had to ship some of our equipment because we have specialty electronics, and uh, my synthesizer stand broke, and right when we were getting ready to set up on stage, we couldn't get it to work. And the crew here was so helpful. I had like three guys get together. They tore down a fence, gave me the fence post, and we bound it all up and got it all working. And their major concern was that it that it looked metal enough for us to play with. It was awesome. So what's the difference between America and here in Germany about uh, how the, the people and your fans are about your music? Are there this much or more or less? Um, we're pretty big. I mean, we have a very committed fan base in the States. And this is our first time to Europe, so it's growing. Um, I was very happy to have a bunch of fans at our first show in Germany that knew the words, that could sing along, Where's really get off, wearing the shirts. So that was a blessing. I didn't think anybody would know. I thought we'd be playing to an empty field, but we weren't, so that was great. Um, and I don't know, It's. Uh, I hope it grows. We want to definitely tour in Europe. Though we have challenges because not everybody speaks our language and we, uh, our GPS, we kind of got lost a few times, but beyond <laughs> that, we're here and we're having a good time. Okay, so wait mal, Death Star Assembly aus Florida. Thank you for the interview. Have a good time in Germany. Drink some beer, the best beer in the world, probably. Yes, so. Thank you so much, you guys rock, you guys.